Welcome to Freedom's Canvas Training. In this training video, you will learn a few things, and then you will take a quiz at the end of this video where you'll answer some questions. The things that you should learn in this video, there are four of them. You need to know how to log in to Freedom's Canvas page. You need to know what an LMS is and what it stands for. You need to know where the global navigation bar is, and you need to know how to edit your profile, biography, and picture. So we'll go through each one of those and I will show you how to do all of those things. So the first thing, log into Freedom's Canvas page. So the website is freedomprep.instructure.com. It's .com, not .net. .com. Hit enter, you'll have to log in. My information is saved on my computer, but you'll just log in with your information and then it will take you right here. Okay, let's talk about Canvas. What is an LMS? An LMS is a learning management system. Learning management system. It's exactly what it sounds like. It is a way to manage students and to help them to learn. People use it, teachers use it in elementary schools, middle schools, high schools, and colleges. Okay, this can be used if you are teaching all online. This is a great way to put videos up for your students to see, have them take quizzes and do assignments online. If you are teaching all in class, it's still a great way to have assignments. Students can log in at school. Students can also log in at home and do homework at home, even if you're teaching full-time in the classroom. Okay, so it's a great system for all of us to be using. So that's LMS, Learning Management System. Third thing that we need to talk about is the global navigation bar. This blue bar over here is the global navigation bar. Has your dashboard, courses, inbox, all of those things. It's called the global navigation bar because this is set for all of your courses. You have a course navigation bar that we'll talk about later, but that's specific to each course. This is the global navigation bar. So your account, whatever you put for your account will be what your students in your language arts class see, what your students in your math class see, it will be the same thing. Okay, your inbox, you will get a message from a student in language arts or a student in your math class. It will go to the same inbox. So all of this stuff is for every student that you have enrolled in any of the courses that you have as a teacher. Okay, and the last thing that I want to talk about is the account right here. I'm going to click on account and I'm going to show you how to edit your profile. So you'll hit account on the global navigation bar and then profile. Once you click on that, it will take you here. You can edit your profile. Some of you might not have anything in there right now, so just hit the edit button in the right corner, and then you will fill in your bio biography and a picture. I just copied what I put on my welcome letter. So if you wanna do the same thing, that is probably the easiest way to do that. That will be your biography and then your picture. If you don't have a picture, you just click this edit button. If you do and you wanna change it, just click that edit button. You can upload a picture by clicking, once you click this, it won't let you do anything. You have to click down here, choose a picture. It's kind of confusing. Um, and you can find one from your desktop or from your downloads. I don't have anything on my computer, so I'm not gonna change it. But if you do and you have a picture saved on your desktop, you can just use that picture. And then you'll just hit a button, it'll open it, and then you can save it. If you want to just take a picture of yourself right then, you can take a picture like that. Either way, anything works. Upload a picture, take a picture. It's really fun for your students to see your picture, so I would put a picture there. And then when you're done, hit save. Okay, I don't have anything to save, so it won't let me save. Okay, so in this video, hopefully you learned how to log in. Hopefully, hopefully you learned what an LMS, what is, learning management system. You learned that this over here, this blue thing, is the global navigation bar, and you now can edit your profile picture and your profile biography. Okay, at the end of this video, if you'll take the quiz to make sure that you learned all the things that you were supposed to, then it will let you go on to module two. Good luck.